if you're not careful and you no clip out of reality in the wrong areas, you will end up in the back rooms, where it's nothing but the stink of old, moist carpet, the madness of mono yellow, the endless background noise of fluorescent lights at maximum humbuzz, and approximately 600 million square miles of randomly segmented empty rooms to be trapped in. God save you if you hear something wandering around nearby, because it sure as hell has heard you. Level 33, The Infinite Mall. Survival Difficulty, Class 2. Unsafe, Secure, Low Entity Count. Level 33 is the 34th level of the back rooms. Description. Level 33 seems to be an empty shopping mall. Most of the stores are owned by major corporations from the real world, but usually have few products in stock or are completely empty. Some stores are closed off by a gate that currently has no known way to open. More often than not, the food courts will be empty, but there's a chance that you can come across a food court or store that has a full stock. When you first enter, there's a very low chance you will encounter a hound, duller, a few death rats, or even a skin stealer. But as you go a dozen miles into the store, the entities, as well as new ones, will start appearing more often. The mall will progressively become more worn down the further you travel. Water will begin appearing to flood the level. The lights will start flickering to the point where they simply won't turn on anymore and the effect on your mental state will begin getting worse as the mall starts to have mold, plants grow over, and metal starts to corrode. Bases, Outposts, and Communities There are no known bases, outposts, or communities on this level. The Corrosion State When you enter, top picture, the walls will be entirely clean, as well as the tiled floor. The floor is completely dry, Lights never flicker, and towns and dullers are very unlikely to encounter. Fifty miles in, the corrosion state will activate, causing the walls appear to have mold on them. A few tiles on the floor are missing, lights flicker every few hours, and you will begin feeling uneasy and feeling constantly watched due to the effect. During the corrosion state, occasional auditory hallucinations are possible. More and more death rats start to roam the wet floors, and the Smiler can now be spotted in darker areas. 100 miles in, parts of the wallpaper on the walls will appear to be ripped off. The mold can cover large areas of the wall. Grass starts growing from cracks in the dry parts of the floor. Water starts filling up to two inches above the floor. Lights begin flickering every few minutes, giving you a headache. You will feel paranoid even in safe shelter. Auditory hallucinations will become common, while significantly less often than the aforementioned auditory hallucinations. Visual hallucinations are possible, as well as the chance to spot an anethica. 200 miles in. Bottom picture. Any wallpaper on walls will be ripped off entirely. Mold will appear covering the walls. Moss will hang from the ceiling. The water level will heighten now to two feet above the floor. Lights will constantly flicker and can turn off and remain that way for several minutes. Effects on the human mind are equivalent to those in level 6, making you go insane faster depending on your personality, sometimes driving you to suicide. Auditory and visual hallucinations will become commonplace, and there's a very low chance that one of these hallucinations can physically hurt or injure you. Entities, especially anethicas, death rats, and smilers will be very common this far in as well. 300 miles in, the walls will appear ripped and damaged like a bomb explosion. There will be grasses growing from the floor up to 6 feet high and the water level will be 5 feet. The lights will be off but will flicker on every few hours. The hallucinations will try to fool you into deadly traps, like getting killed by entities. 500 miles in, the floor and lights will be non-existent, but there will be fires from the ground. If you make it this far, 
Be warned, as the hallucinations will most likely try to physically injure you. Entities are always waiting for you to look up to the ceiling. 750 miles in, the walls appear to be pipes. If you look anywhere but forward, there are entities. A monster. Hallucinations are no longer hallucinations. Fires and water from the ground, and ivy everywhere. Later, an unknown individual reportedly traveled 1,000 miles in. It was described to have 23-foot weeds, have black voids for walls, with the occasionally broken and corroded pipe, and interior that was all simple, indescribable chaos. He was later chased back by a group of about 200 extremely aggressive entities. He advised to go no further, but attempts are being made to go even further. Entrances and Exits the only known ways are to enter a shopping center, or a mall in level 11, or go upstairs at level 22. If you entered from level 11, go back through the doors you entered from. If you came from level 22, go back down the stairs behind you. You can also go to level 45 by entering an office entranceway. <laughs>